Sam. Got it. Well, some are calling it the COVID-15 or even 30 about weight gain while so many stayed home throughout the pandemic. And now obesity is concerning health officials. Joining us to talk about that is Dr. Darren Tischler, Chief of Bariatrics at Hartford HealthCare's Hartford Hospital. Doctor, welcome. Hi, Lisa. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Now, what impact has COVID-19 had on weight gain from things you're seeing as a physician? I think there are two areas where we've seen an impact uh, from COVID-19. The first is the more obvious one to me, which is the loss of activity with so many things being canceled and not having to even maybe even drive to work. Maybe only take a few steps to go from from, you know, part of your house to the other part of the house to commute to work every day. So we're losing activity. But at the same time, there's also been a lot of increased stress, anxiety, um, loss of sleep. And I think these factors also contribute to weight gain. I know there's so much we're dealing with right now. What are some of the triggers that may have been caused by COVID-19? Well, I think the big triggers uh, that I've seen are just the all-out loss of activity. Um, people just are not walking, going out, um, maybe even taking their kids somewhere. Um, there's a little activity, these little bits of activity all throughout the day do add up. And, and by decreasing that activity, we're losing the ability to burn off extra calories. I, I know. I think people with dogs have been some of the busiest during this walking. <laughs> all right. How can people who are struggling get back on track? Well, I think the most important part is to find new ways to um, get activity uh, into your life again. Uh, maybe going to the gym is not an option, but going for a walk. Uh, we've started with our own support group, a weekly walk with a doc. I do a Facebook Live uh, broadcast every Saturday just to encourage people to get out. And I walk with my family and now my new extended family of about a thousand people on our support group. Oh, I love that. What is your Facebook page if people want to follow you? Uh, it, it's the Hartford Healthcare Surgical Weight Loss Support Group on Facebook. Excellent. So, um, you know, we're really working to find new ways to engage people to really keep them in tune and understanding that it's important to seek care for obesity. Uh, we've, uh, we haven't gone away. We're still here. We're still working hard. Uh, and obesity has become just a major uh, issue, especially with COVID-19. All right. Tell us all about the resources offered by Hartford HealthCare. Absolutely. Um, well, we have both a surgical weight loss program where we deal with weight loss surgery as well as a non-surgical weight loss program for people who may need uh, medications or to try something a little different uh, under a medical supervision. We also have a combination of health specialists, including psychologists, nutritionists, um, cardiologists, and exercise physiologists, all as one team to work together towards uh, helping people to really see what they can gain through weight loss. All right, and I see whatwillyougain.org is on the screen there if people want to find out more. And we just have about 15 seconds left, but are people more open to bariatric surgery and things like that in these times? Well, I think at the very beginning of the pandemic, people were reluctant to seek health care, but now I think people are more focused than ever. And the big message to give people is see your health care providers, get the health care you need. The pandemic's probably not going away anytime in the next couple months. But we're here for you to uh, take care of all those health care needs. All right, Dr. Darren Tischler, thank you so much for the information. Thank you for having me. Thank you.